happy Friday Eve weekend just around the corner and we want to get you ready. Yes, this is a new little segment we're trying out each uh -oh. week. We're going to kind of round up some of the top events round happening around town. OK, OK, let's start with this. Friday, the iconic DAP fashion show will take the runway at Mega Corp Pavilion in Newport. The fashion show features unique creations from 29 student designers in a venue that features stellar seating, immersive lighting and sound and doors for that will open at 630. You think people are dap or ever like dap me up? They ever do that? Probably not. I don't know what it's that probably means. Not. Well, let me tell you, it's pretty hip. Uh, also <laughs> Friday, the WWE Friday Night Smackdown. Make a stop here at the old Heritage Bank Center downtown. See all your favorite WWE superstars like L.A. Knight, AJ Styles, Jimmy Uso, and more. That's right. Also this weekend, the Cincinnati Art Museum will host Art in Bloom. You can see creative floral displays inspired by fine art. It runs from 11 a.m. to 5 p.m. Friday through Sunday. But on Friday night, the monthly Art After Dark program will feature works from the Art in Bloom. There will also be music, dance performances, a flower bar, and more. And that runs Friday from 5 to 9, and admission for that is free. Asian Food Fest will be happening Saturday and Sunday down on the Court Street Plaza in Cincinnati. Hours 11 a.m. to 10 p.m. Saturday, 11 to 8 Sunday. This two-day food extravaganza celebrating Asian culture and cuisine features 56 different restaurants oh. and food trucks mm. alongside mm -hmm. a secret menu. Eight, in fact, secret menu options, yeah. cultural activities, entertainment, and more await you. In the 9 o'clock, are we having some, some folks from Asian Addy in? We are. I yes, th today I think, we are. I think we yep. are. Yep. So yep. stick today. around for that on Local 12 in yeah. a little bit. Well, also on Saturday, you can still celebrate Earth Day at the Greater Cincinnati Earth Day Festival. It will take place at Summit Park in Blue Ash from 5 to 9, or excuse me, Noon to five. Where did I get five tonight? I don't know. Noon to five. And you can enjoy live music, food trucks, and entertainment while learning about environmental issues. And admission is free for that. Saturday night, FC Cincinnati going to take on the Colorado Rapids. 730 TQL Stadium. They call it the Fortress. Make sure to get down to Washington Park early. Take part in all the pregame activities, the tailgate, and then march over to the Fortress together. Love the march. Comedian Cat Williams brings his Dark Matter tour to Heritage Bank Center downtown on Saturday night. Doors open at 630 and the show starts at 8. And don't forget that Kings Island is now open for weekends. Hours for Friday and Saturday right now are 10 to 9. Sunday it is 10 to 7. We, we have officially, I think, reached that point of the year where there is something going on every single weekend. And I don't just mean, you know, Kings Island is going to be open, you know, every weekend, of course, but there's a festival, there's a, there's a food fest, there's a thing, there's a whatever. Festival season has arrived. Yes, my Lord, we can do up a festival. Two things I wanted to mention. Oh, well, first you mentioned that boy. in the 9 o'clock we're going to have folks from yes, the from Asian Addy. Asian Addy coming yes. in to talk about the festival and they're going to yes. show foods and all kinds of things. But mm -mm, this is I you. am very excited I about know. this. Tomorrow on our 9 o'clock hour of Good Morning Cincinnati on Local 12. L.A. Knight from WWE, the, the superstar, L.A. Knight. Right. Yeah, is going to be in with us, and I get to interview him. Okay, now listen. A lot of people might not understand by just knowing of Jen Dalton's sweet demeanor, her loving tone. You are, with both wrestling and, like, and UFC kind arts. of stuff. You're, I like them both. You dig that stuff. Yes, I do. You did, like, some almost, like, ringside reporting, didn't you, for Not UFC almost, for a while? I did, yes. Yeah. Uh, and it was, was it on the CW or was it on Star 64? I can't remember. Those are two different things, by the way. Yeah, they are two different stations of ours. <laughs> uh, I, we had a show a long time ago, <laughs> I and know. I was the ringside reporter. I, I know. Where I interviewed did, them. Did, like, blood and sweat? Yes, and, yes. Wow. Yes, that happened. That's quite a gig. Hey there. Yeah, you could stop watching right now, but let's be honest, you don't want to do that. Hit the links or click subscribe to see more amazing content from all of us here at Local 12.